Hey, in this video, I will walk you through Procreate Dreams export features, including how to export a video, including with transparency, as well as how to export images in your Dreams project file. To start out, let's walk through how to find the export options inside a project. First, inside your project, tap on the title of the project in the top left corner of the timeline. This will bring up your movie settings, which includes navigation on the left side. To get to the export options, you will need to tap on share. Now we have several quick export options, including video, frames as video, current frame, and procreate dreams. So I'm going to go ahead and tap on video. After it exports the video, you will get this overlay with options to save your video or share it using apps on your iPad. I'm going to save it to my Photos app by tapping on Save Video. If you're like me, you probably also want to be able to export transparent animations. Unfortunately, Procreate Dreams doesn't currently support exporting transparent video formats, so I'm going to show you my workaround that I have been using. To start out, you will want to make sure to remove the background from your file. To do this, you will want to tap on the time code, which will either be on the left or right side of your stage area. This will bring up your stage options. Now let's tap on background color at the bottom and tap on the toggle to make your background transparent. And as you can see, now our background is gone. Now we're ready to export. So let's tap on the title to bring up our movie settings. And this time in the share options, you will want to tap on frames as images. This will generate a folder with pink images of every frame. And because we remove the background, they will all be transparent pink images. And now there's a couple of ways you can use the pink images. I like to export them to my computer so I can import them as a PNG sequence into a video program like After Effects or Premiere Pro. Another option for users with Procreate is to save the folder to your iPad files and then import the images into Procreate and use Procreate to export the animation as either a transparent video or an animated GIF. Next I'm going to show you how to export a video thumbnail. The first step is to position the action button on the specific frame that you'd like to make an image. Once you're satisfied, enter the movie settings and in the share settings, you will tap current frame. After it exports, you will get an overlay with options to save or share your image. Choose your preferred option and you're done. Procreate Dreams also has some more advanced export options. This allows you to customize the format and scale of your export. You can find the advanced settings under the quick export options on the share page. Tap on Customize Settings. A new overlay will appear with some options you can customize. The first option you have is to change the format. Tapping on Frames as Images will change the rest of the options. Here we have the ability to choose from a couple options to rescale the images that are exported. Next, you have the option to change the file container to other image file formats like PNG, JPEG, and TIFF. Now let's go back to the video options by tapping on the format and selecting video. The first video option we have is Video Kodak. This gives you the ability to choose from H.264 and HEVC and ProRes options. Here's a quick cheat sheet on the different video codecs. Feel free to pause or screenshot. Next, we have the option to rescale using some preset sizes, as well as the option to input a customized size. Next, we have the option to choose to make our video an MOV or MP4. Lastly, we have the option to choose from linear PCM or AAC for our audio. Once you're satisfied with your modifications, you can tap on export in the top right and save your file. Next, I'll show you how to export your dreams project so others can work on it. 
So inside your share options, you will see an option in the quick export options called Procreate Dreams. This will export your project file as a .drm file which as with the other options, you can save to your iPad or share it using one of the apps. It's important to note that when you export the Dreams file this way, the document doesn't keep any of your undo history. So if you need to keep the history of a project, you will need to exit your project and export from the theater. So let's walk through how to export a file from the theater. To start out, tap and hold on the movie you wish to export, and then tap on Share. You will be given the option to export the movie as a video, frames as images, or a Procreate Dreams file. And by tapping on Procreate Dreams, you will get the option to export as a reduced file size or to export the file with the full undo history. This is the only way currently to export with the full history included. I just walked you through all the current options for exporting and Procreate Dreams. It's important to note that the Procreate team has been working on version 1.1, which will include some big updates for export, including the ability to export animate GIFs and the ability to export transparent video files. If you're interested in learning about the future updates coming to Procreate Dreams, then check out my video on version 1.1. You can also check out my Procreate Dreams playlist for additional Procreate Dreams tutorials and updates. Thanks for watching.